Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and this is a uh, quick video to talk about the news and interest panel. It started to roll out now. So this is 281H1 which is my machine. It didn't have this uh, and it's now part of the machine when I go on the bottom. I have the weather and of course there's the app with the news and uh, information. So it's actually rolling out and um, it's actually rolling out to some people because I've here received a few comments of uh, people on um, version um, 2004 and 20H2 that they have seen the panel appear uh, magically on their computer. So this is, of course, the new panel of news and interest that Microsoft is trying out for everybody. It will show up as the weather, first of all, so it shows you the weather at the bottom in your taskbar. And it, of course, has the little flyout where you can actually customize all of this and see what you can actually, uh, the news reports and stuff like that. Now, this one looks like this on this PC because of probably the, the screen size that I choose for my uh, recording. Uh, on your side, it can be multiple news items in different ways. Also depends on your screen resolution that you're using. Um, so, you know, it's one of those things that personally, apart from the fact that I have the weather on the taskbar, I uh, don't think I will ever use this. Um, I find that the news items that they bring out isn't that great. And honestly, um, I think a lot of you will do exactly what a lot of us will do. It's simply right click on the taskbar, go into the task, man task manager, sorry guys. A little tired here. Go ahead, right click on the taskbar, go into the news and interest, and just turn it off, and it will just not be there in your PC. If you are curious, you can always turn it on at any time and check out the new versions if you want. Uh, as you see here, I don't have a lot of space on my taskbar at the bottom, so having that show up even with the weather is taking some space that I need, so I will probably be turning it off. On my other computer that I'm using, which is an Insider machine, I have a very high screen resolution. So the taskbar has a lot of space. On that one, I'm going to leave it for the weather. But for the rest, it's um, you know one of those little things that Microsoft is trying out. Uh, it, the news items and stuff on it comes from Bing. So it's you know a way for them to kind of have us go into Bing. But honestly, I... I click on it. I click on the fact that you can manage all this stuff. I clicked on the fact that you can, um, you know, uh, by the way, there's uh, you can manage your interests here. So you go with the browser and manage it online. So it brings you to the, uh, the Bing page, the major Bing page, if you want to, you know, just check it out. So simply, uh, you know, if you want to try it out and manage it, just go here at the top, right, manage interests. Honestly, I've been playing around with the managing of interests, and it's always it, there are tons of things that it's showing up that I don't care about. So that's another another where reason why you know I I'm not interested in this. It seems that it's just bringing up a lot of crap that I don't care. Um, you know, I, I ask it for tech and regular news, and I get uh, you know I don't know Celine Dion stuff, and it's like yeah I don't care. I don't want that. That's not what I asked for. So. Uh, like everybody, like a lot of people, actually, I think this is will be a right click and news and interest and turn off. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.